All right, we are back, and these trams that we put in in Nogales in the last episode, they're not doing too hot. So far, they're not moving too many people. Yeah, they're not really making me much money. But we did just put them down, so I'm not too mad at them. And I think we're going to be getting a lot more use once we set up connection between Nogales and uh, Globe and Yuma. So, let's do it. Hmm, I guess we're going to be expanding this direction since I conveniently smushed the tram depot right there. Decisions. Okay, uh, let's pick a good path. Uh, country road? No, that's not a country road. This is a country road. 50 miles an hour, fine. Uh, yes, please. Leaving town. Okay. Stupid zigzags. I might... I'm gonna demolish that. That's gonna go away. Um... Now, do I want to cross my track here, or maybe build a nice little tunnel through the mountain? I think I want to build a nice little tunnel through the mountain, and you know what? Since I said I was gonna destroy this anyway, might as well do it now. Okay. So... Uh, country road, yep, a little zigzag. What is that? Garbage. Okay, there we go. Okay, put you right there, but then, you know, right around here, we're gonna have our, our little bypass route. Go straight on through. Oh, that looks pretty clean. And uh, I'd like to see a little better. There you go. Maybe a little something like that. Okay. And then we'll continue to upgrade. All right. Uh, where is the bus stop? Does Yuma not have? Did I do it again? <laughs> no, Yuma has public transportation somewhere. Ah, here it is. I was just blind. Okay. How's it look? It looks a little cramped. Otherwise, <laughs> not in use. Perfect. All right, so Nogales, we are gonna hook you up right now. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. do we do? I think we do a little a road over here, so we kind of stay off of our um street right there. Let's go here. We'll keep it urban, medium, and this is our bus stop. So we will go. Actually, you know what? Let's just make another one. No, 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 no. Let's make another bus stop over here. And anybody that gets dropped off at this stop should be able to wander to the bus stop relatively easily. So let's do that. Uh, da, da, da. Bus or tram. I mean, we could just make another stop. And I might end up doing that. I don't know. Let's put you right there. Uh, and since I didn't check before I put it down, I might as well check now. I made it electric. I did a one in one and 30 meters. Okay. Now, do we want to move? Uh, no, I don't think so. Let's let them walk. They can walk. I didn't need to make this electric, but it's fine. It's fine. Um, okay. Now, do we want to change this up? I feel like demolishing this road and doing a road right out the back and then maybe get rid of this. Let's do it. Sorry. Sorry. 
you guys were trying to work on your infrastructure and I just shattered your dreams. Um, ba -ba, street access right there. Okay. Uh, let's get a road going. Uh, we are in the city, so we'll do a little urban medium straight shot. What? Nah, nah. Do I want bus lanes? I know I do not need the tram, but actually I might... I don't know. There's not much traffic. No, no bus lane. We're not going to do it. Whoa, no, 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 what'd you, ah, what'd you guys do? Stop it. Stop it. Pause. I have plans for this road. There. There, now see what kind of mischief you guys get up to. There. You now I'll throw you a bone. We will, I'll put that there for you. And you know what, I'll even... Can we do it right in the middle? There you go. Let's let's make that intersection even more messed up. There. You guys happy now? You should be happy. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. I think it's time for a new line, right? Right? Right. New line. From you all the way up here to you. And it did take the tunnel that I wanted. Perfect. Okay, um, to make that a dark green color, let's call you Road Passenger. Uh, what is this? No, is this still No Gallus? Where are we? Yeah, this is No Gallus. No Gallus to Yuma. Wonderful. And now all that is left is to throw some buses on it and we are gonna go with these bad boys uh four I feel like four is probably a pretty good number um come on come on um uh, there all right oh yeah and we can push play now because now they can't try and mess with my roads. Okay, so we'll let that happen, and we'll check on that. And in the meanwhile, let's get going on our road to Globe. Um, this looks like a nice way in. What is this? This goes to this farm. Oh, but it used to connect to this road before I destroyed it. <laughs> Eh, I guess I get to make it again. Um, or should I? On this road? No. I feel like, yeah, maybe continue this road on. Uh, do a bridge or something? I don't know. Connect it here? Oh, I'm kind of torn. I hate making roads. I, I just, no, I hate it. Um, I do like the idea of coming in off of this road though. Instead of going this way, coming that way. Although, hang on. This, I mean, yeah. We do have to, yeah. I didn't want to drive through there. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You know what, if I made a road go this way and hook up, I bet people would stop driving through here. Shall we find out? We shall. Uh, da -da -da, don't mind me, I'm just a road. There. Come on. You know you want to take a left. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Mission accomplished. Okay. So I'm pretty sure that will get rid of all of this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on here? What? We have a, a problem here. Well, these are older trucks. That's a bit of a problem. Let's go ahead and fix that one. There. 
now you can carry a little bit more okay so these guys should start using that road and I think I'm gonna start using it too to bus people to globe okay where is here it is you know what I wonder which way the line would go naturally I feel like this it's got to go here if I pick this right let's find out new line um, from you all the way down here to you okay good it, it wants to take this road I can get behind that all right and where is this globe so this is Nogales to globe let's change the name road passenger Nogales globe done all right now I won't add a platform I will let it share for the time being until it gives me a reason otherwise and just like the other line let's get four vehicles up oh, right there all right there they are rolling out and have you guys cleaned your act up yet no <laughs> just went from negative 34 to negative forty two thousand dollars Although maybe maybe the reverse loop is doing better. You know, you can't judge both loops by one guy. How are you doing? Negative 26. Not too much better. But it's fine. Because now we have transit to Yuma and we have transit to Globe. I think that's going to up the amount of people that our loops pick up. There they go. Okay. I'm happy with that. I think we can move on from that. So we'll check on that at the end of the episode. Until then, let's go down to Globe. And I also have big plans for the airports too. I think, because we have four airports and only two are connected to two. You know, it's kind of like a one-way thing. I want to connect the entire map together via passenger lines and also maybe put down a few more airports. We'll see. We'll see. That will not be for today's episode. That That's going to wait. Okay, Globe is fantastic as far as their vehicles go. I don't need to update anything. They've already got the best trams chilling here. Um, is there another bus station in here? I don't think so. Okay, let's look at Yuma. Oh, this is a bit of a dated truck, isn't it? He's losing money too. How do you lose money when there's just the two of you? Just the two of us. Sorry. I have to sing that whenever I hear just the two of us. Okay. Um, and I'm singing the Will Smith version, too. Just so you know. Uh, what do I do with these guys? Why do they suck so bad? Is there just the two of you? Oh, no. There's three. Maybe I get rid of all of them and just do one semi-truck? Let's do it. Um, you're fired, and you get an awesome shiny new truck, but let's get back to the passenger system. What's going on here? Okay, we have some older buses. Not terribly old, but they're not the latest greatest, so let's see how they're doing. Uh, the Nogales to Yuma line, we just put that in, and of course it's losing a bunch of money because it hasn't had time to do anything yet. Uh, how about the Yuma Loop? The Yuma Loop is losing money, even though there's all these people here. Oh, that's because you're the shuttle. You're not the loop. Wait, you only picked up five? Oh, are there multiple sharing the same? Oh, you guys are waiting to go to Nogales. Right? Yeah, you're the shuttle. Okay. So, where is our Nogales bus? Are they close? They gotta be close. Oh, here it is, right? Yeah, Nogales to Yuma. And he's bringing 26. Okay, we are gonna be making money with that line. 
Let's actually see. He's at negative 80 right now. Oh, just went to 68. Weird. Uh, come on, drop off. And he's definitely going to have a full load to pick up. All right. Just like that, in the green, 135. And he picked up 26 more. I like it. I like it a lot, and that means more people are going to be using the loops. Okay. Before we pat ourselves on the back too hard, let's actually go into this loop, which is losing money. And I think somebody's going to get fired. Who's losing the most amount of money? It looks like you. You're fired. Now, should I fire the other guy? Well, you guys aren't spaced out very well. Actually, you're causing a traffic jam for us. Uh, yes, thank you. Get out of the way. That means you're not going to have very much to pick up. Yeah, zero. Okay, well, they'll, they'll space themselves out and uh, be better. Whoa, the next guy's already here? But it's way over there. You guys aren't spaced out any better than that? Come on. Come on. Okay. But what was... I, I was looking at the loop. And I'm wondering, do I keep these two vehicles? Or do I sell one and just upgrade to that, um, you know, this nicer, newer bus? And just let one bus... Yeah, you know what? I'm sold. I'm sold. Although, it says the loop. Oh, this is the loop. I think the loop has lots of people on it. I don't know. Maybe it's going to turn itself around? Hmm. Who are you? You're the shuttle. How are you doing money-wise, shuttle? You're losing a ton. Is that because nobody wants to ride the train? Oh, well. Just dropped off a good amount. No, I just think we don't need four vehicles for such a short drive. Yeah, let's let's manage it. Let's actually gonna sell three of you, and you. What's the biggest? Yeah, this has the highest capacity. There. It may not be the best means of efficiently moving people to our train, but you know what? That train is kind of a bit of a loser. Well, actually, I don't know. Did it pick up? 40 out of 40. What's going on over here? You, you guys know I don't like it when this many trucks are in a line. Did I upgrade and not go back and take a look at you? Where are you guys doing? Okay. That's why. Because you guys are usually putting in a good amount of work when the train comes and drops off some. There's the train. Let's actually see if all of these trucks are warranted or not. Okay, what do you got? What do you got for us? 79. Okay, so that's all gonna drop right there. Now, are these trucks gonna pick it up and go or are we still gonna have somebody waiting behind? I feel like we're still gonna have an extra guy. Eh, well, he picked up a little bit. You know what? We'll leave it. We, eh. No, no, you. I'm gonna sell you. Just because. Okay, nine vehicles. Nice round number. Uh, what's going on here? You guys waiting for the shuttle? The shuttle's gonna come and pick you up. Uh, 23 people bringing it. Okay, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Sure, we could get more people to the train. What? Are you doing? Where are you going? Why did you do it? That's all I want to know. If you could answer me that, I will let you keep your job. What was that garbage? Goodbye, road. And I'm kind of curious to see if he's going to do that kind of stupidness on this side now. We might just have this road come up in dead end right here if my driver continues to be stupid. Okay. Um, for the shuttle. Okay, I, I figured. Uh, you, sir, are gonna get a little bit of help now. 
I'm sorry that I cut you down as short as I did. Where is our vehicle depot? Right there. Okay, so there's his help. That's fine. It actually looks like it might be uh, spaced out pretty well. By the time he drops off, the new bus, where are you? Oh, you're stuck at a light. Never mind. Okay, what are you going to do? Are you going to be stupid? You're going to be stupid. Oh my god, why? Is that on your route? Why is that on your route? Why would that be there? Oh, you know what? I bet if I get rid of this, that will stop. Boom! It didn't help. <laughs> but at least he should stop here first. And then do the stupid unnecessary stuff. That's really weird. That's, I, I, I don't understand it. Let's see. What's he gonna do? He did stop first, and now he's gonna drive all the way out. Maybe just so it doesn't look so stupid, I should loop the road and give him a, a way back. You know what? The things I do so that my drivers don't look too stupid. I should get some kind of an award. Um, maybe something like that. I don't know. What's it look like? Okay, they're going full loopy loop. That's fine. Why does do these? Oh, this is. Oh, okay. It's because I need to do an urban street. Boom. Now it all looks better. Can't go as fast, but you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Okay, this looks a little bit special. It could use a little bit of decoration in the middle. Uh, are you guys doing any better? You are. You're not terribly overcrowded. 21 waiting for the Yuma shuttle, and here comes the Yuma shuttle. Bringing 26 to use our passenger lines. Where are you going? Okay, only picked up 21. Okay, that's fine. I, th I think we've got that just about dialed in. You have three people on the whole bus. That's fine, I guess. That's fine. Okay, we still have our line here. This guy's about to drop off, and they should hopefully all disappear. If they all disappear, I'll be happy with that. Yes, they all disappeared. And the next guy shows up. That's perfect. I can get behind that. Okay, so who's next? We've done a lot of good work here so far. Did we do Tucson already? I'm already drawing a blank. This is a big hot mess, but yes, they do look like they have the new trams and the new buses, so we're not going to mess with Tucson. Uh, Paige. I don't think we've been down to Paige in a long time. We have neglected Paige hard. Uh, it is one of our smaller towns. Okay, first off, how are you guys doing on your goods? It looks like, uh, fine. Right? I mean, you're getting what you need, right? Yeah, 100%. Paige is totally happy with their goods supply. And why shouldn't they be? They are right next to the factory. They should be the first to get their share. Okay. We have our uh, little fuel factory back here. How are they doing? I'm kind of curious. This is one of the first lines we ever did, was this oil line. I think it may have been in the first episode or two. And we, we haven't looked at it in a long time. <laughs> yeah, it's got these older diesels on it. I'm pretty sure we could upgrade it and make it better, but you know what? Why? Well, actually, we may, because this actually is a fat stack of oil waiting for something. Uh, where is this going? Oil to fuel. Okay, so it's actually this guy we need to make a little bit bigger. You know what? Let's do that. Let's up him to, say, like a 150. Okay, let's replace. First off, let's pick... Um, Oh, that speed looks really tasty. But I think we're going to go with uh, this guy. Yeah. 
just for that raw horsepower and tractive effort. Uh, cargo. What are we moving? Liquids. Oh, I think this is the first time we've used this newer tank car with that super good MPH that we cannot take advantage of. Um, what do we say? 150? Yeah, let's go 160. Bam! Okay. Where is he? Over here, he's on his way back. So that's going to make uh, this guy really happy too, even though, I mean, we're nowhere near having issues. We're only sending out 261. We're not even capped out here. Although it is, it, it is a little shady that we don't have the ability to do 400 yet, but I'm thinking upgrading that one train is going to make it all happen. Pretty sure this stack, yeah, which is now overcrowded, is not going to be there for long. Yeah, and just like that, half of it disappeared. And it's going to be hauling some butt compared to that last train, too. Ooh. Actually, I think these trains actually go fairly fast. Yeah, he was going 75. But this one's going to get up to speed a little better. Okay, but we weren't here to fiddle with the cargo trains. Oh, passenger train, how good are you doing? Well, you're not doing too great. You just dropped off passengers and you're at negative one million dollars. I'd say that means we have issues. We will make a note to look at him later. Okay, so now he drops off oil. He's going to pick up some fuel. All right, and he's out of here. Okay, yeah, we're definitely going to see the production go up to 400. Uh, okay, and you guys cute little trucks are more than doing your job of supplying fuel, right? Yeah, 100%. Paige is a very happy town. Paige has no complaints, but it's got some older buses. You know, it's time for them to join the, uh, the 21st century. What do we got here? We've got the shuttle. The shuttle is making money. I'm happy about that. But let's go ahead. What kind of buses are these? The fishbowl. Um, we don't even have the fishbowl anymore. It's so old, it's not even an option. Okay. How many people does the fishbowl carry? 15. Okay. Hmm. Do we need to go all out for the streetcar? There's two of these vehicles. They carry 15, so that's a 30 altogether. This does 26. So 26, one vehicle would not be able to keep up with what we're doing, and I think two might be overkill, but you know what? Let's do it. Because it's all about getting people to and from the train. Now, I doubt we're going to need to go that big for the inner city loops. But yeah, for the shuttle vehicle, why not? Okay. And you, are you also a fishbowl? <laughs> Such a weird name for a bus. I can't tell. Um, here. Fishbowl, yeah. Okay, then we're gonna we're gonna update you. Uh da, da, da. Hmm. Kinda like these that carry 19. The Maz, but the Volvo is quite nice. Hmm. The Volvo is cheaper. I usually don't base my decision off of that, but we just did it. Take a look at it. Nice looking. Okay. Uh, you, sir, fishbowl, come here. Let's go ahead and upgrade you as well to the Volvo. That's that's everybody. All right, so Paige is uh is doing good, a little happier. I want I want to see that train though. Where'd that train go? He is docked. Okay, he's carrying fifty back. Why are you losing so much money? I mean, that's not terrible. That's not a terrible amount. 
word of thumb is like if you can fill it 50 percent then you can make money maybe this one is just a terribly expensive train hmm going on here okay we're not quite as backed up as this led me to believe i thought i saw multiple little boulder pictures here i thought i saw like four the game has me seeing things okay so we're done with page page is happy uh let's scoot on over to phoenix phoenix how are you doing talk to me what well what is this What that is is 43 people waiting on a bus is what that is oh no wonder it's waiting on a fishbowl that carries 15 people okay so phoenix needs our help and we're gonna help it uh where's the bus stop is it over here is this it yeah phoenix loop is that all you got there's nobody close we didn't do like a phoenix to scottsdale drive well i guess not because we do have the train we got to leave some money for the train, I guess. Okay, uh, let's go to the Phoenix Loop. Whoa, that's a lot of buses. And we're making money, too. Okay. Um, Oh, is it going to be super sketchy overkill if I upgrade to these guys? I think going to the Moz is... Or not the Moz, but the Volvo is going to be good. Well, uh, that's only two. Maybe we spring for the Moz for that 19, but I don't think we need the 26. Let's do that. I think that'll be perfect. It won't waste too much money. And I think it will destroy, you know, all these people waiting. That extra four capacity per bus. I think it's gonna do good things. Phoenix is looking good, by the way. Look, the skyscrapers are on point. Is the gym still around here? I remember there was a gym. Oh, you know what? It's now a uh, walk. I guess uh, they replaced uh, the fitness place. Or is it over here? Oh, here we go. Lift gym. But I thought that lift gym was in a taller building. But no, here we go. Okay, here's the gym. The sign is spinning. It looks like they're open for business, even though my gym is not open for business. Not yet, but soon. Okay. We're going to call that an episode right now. If you guys like the episode, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and come back for the next episode, and we will see what kind of trouble we can get into once again. See ya.